Johnny Wachter, an actor best known for playing Brando Corbin on General Hospital, was shot and killed on May 25th in Los Angeles when three men allegedly attempted to steal the catalytic converter from his car, People has confirmed. Wachter was 37. According to Kapka's mother, Sharon Wachter, said that he was leaving work at a downtown rooftop bar when he saw what appeared to be someone working on his car. Thinking his car was being towed, he approached the man, who she claims then opened fire without warning. LAPD confirmed to Entertainment Weekly that around 3.25 a.m., white male, age 30 to 35, was the victim in a robbery attempt at the same location point three suspects sped off in a vehicle and paramedics took Wachter to a hospital where he was pronounced dead. The Charleston native began his acting career in 2007, appearing in minor roles in Army Wives, and over the years appeared in shows such as NCIS, The OA, and Westworld. In 2020, he landed the recurring role of Brandon Corbin on General Hospital, filming 164 episodes through 2022. He most recently appeared in the film Supercell and Dead Talk Tales Volume, one in the series Barbie Rehab and Station 19. Wachter also had a couple upcoming projects, including the film American Sognair, which is currently in post-production. Johnny Wachter was a spectacular human being, Wachter's talent agent David Shaw said in a statement to Variety. Not just a talented actor who was committed to his craft, but a real moral example to everyone who knew him. Standing for hard work, tenacity, and a never-give-up attitude. In the highs and lows of a challenging profession, he always kept his chin up and kept striving for the best he could be, Shaw said in a statement. Our time with Johnny was a privilege we would wish on everyone. He would literally give you the shirt off his back. After over a decade together, he will leave a hole in our hearts forever.